hello guys my name is Sakode in this video I will show you how to use Google Drive web interface in your window machine so to start click on any browser of your choice in the address bar you type drive.google.com slash drive access Google Drive web interface by logging with your email and password so type in your email and password and click on next login onto your Google Drive web portal this is my Google web Drive web portal so my Google web drive portal on the right side you find suggestion find folders and in the suggestion that shows all the file that you want to have access to it easily or uh, and we have folders it shows all the folders that have been created on your google drive web portal and we have file this shows all the files that have been created so to access it by clicking on drive it will move you to the root from your Google Drive web portal. The web portal suggestion shows suggestion. we have files, folders. It shows all the folders that have been created. We have files. So to create a folder by clicking on new, you can create a folder. on the that you can upload files and upload folders or you can create the a Google Doc document onto your Google Drive web portal create an Excel sheet and when you click on more you'll find more Google products that is used to organization. Click connect to more app. Connect to an app to your Google Drive accounts. Be used. And in my drive, we have a little icon. By expanding it, you will find all the folders that have been created on my Google Drive web portal cloud. You should, you'll find all the folders that have been created on my Google Drive. And we have computers. I click on computer tab, you'll find all the file or folder that have been linked to your Google Drive for easy synchronization from your computer onto your Google Drive account. And we have share with me it shows all the files that have been shared with a colleague or a team member I click on share with me you'll find all the files that have been shared and we have recent it shows all the recent files that have been opened today earlier week and we have star this shows files by clicking on file to be star it will it is for easy access and it can be easily removed from your google drive accounts you can add the file onto your star Let's add a file by clicking on the file you click on add star. This will pinpoint the file for easy identification or for easy accessibility 
on your web portal you can remove it from star i click on on you can open it you can share the file you can share the file link you can share file location or you can add a shortcut to your go drive or move a file from one location to another or you can remove the file from star you can rename it and view the file details that have been pink on star food star files view the details that have been attached to that files you can remove you have trash issues all the deleted files that you have deleted from your google drive web portal and through here you can restore it going trash find the files that have been deleted so if you want to restore you click on restore click on that particular file then we will restore and we have storage storage it shows all the files that have been stored on my google drive web portal and the storage size is 15 gig so to buy additional more you can click on buy storage buy additional gig to current read size current storage size is 15 gig you can also add 100 gig to it you can also add 200 gig. and also add 2 terabyte with it that come with a cost monthly and when you click on my drive to move you to the root location or root dashboard on your google drive web portal and when you click on my drive by expanding it you can with it's now folder in your in your google drive you can also upload files you can upload folders from your computer onto your google drive and you can also read a word document or excel sheet onto your google drive accounts and we have search field in the search field you can type the file for easy search or for easy identification if you want to find a file in your google drive accounts by typing the file name it will pop up for easy identification or for easy open from your google drive web portal and we have office preview offline preview you can enable this for your google drive for us to be offline without internet you can access your google drive your computer the device and we have help you can find help from google google site you can find any training on send google drive you can find by clicking update you will find update from google then we have terms and condition or terms and policy it shows all the terms and policy of google drive sign with your google drive we have settings in the settings 
click on settings you can find your storage device size you can buy additional storage by clicking on buy storage buy additional storage to your current storage we have settings and we have notification in the setting you can untick the suggestion tab this will remove the suggestion from your home portal you won't find any suggestion on your google drive portal by deselecting it and click that you won't find any suggestion but you can enable it by going to settings then you take then you take the suggestion then you click done this will show all the suggestion files for easy identification and we have notification to show all the notification on your google drive accounts and we have manage app this to all the app that have been attached to your google drive from here you can enable an app to work or you can disable an app to work with your google drive portal by clicking on option perform the task you want to disable it or if you want to enable it we have get drive to desktop this will help you download your drive app software to your computer and install your computer for you to sign using your computer the accessibility to your Google Drive web portal clicking on get it you can download right for the desktop clicking on download that will be download and we have shortcut it shows all the shortcut that you can use keyboard shortcut that you can use using your google drive a portal on your computer and we have display option and choose to display your file in italics where or list your folder the specification and by clicking on the file you can find file details Decided by clicking on details then we have google apps by clicking on google apps you can go to google play store you can go to youtube you can go to email you can go to google drive you can go to google calendar schedule like you can use google translate translate your word or the place a website from one language to another then click on drive go to the you have google you can go to google and use google meet you can use google chat this google app show all the google app that have been attached to your onedrive web portal beside it and choose to click on calendar find it or 
schedule a meeting in your Google Drive. Then we have keep and clicking on keep. You can keep a note. Your Google Keep. We have Google Tax. You can schedule a tax to perform a daily routine. We have app clicking on the plus icon you attach any app your google drive accounts easy accessibility I click plus and scroll through By clicking on drive it will move you to home directory google drive web portal by that you can click on the file to preview the file or you can open your google doc you can share the file you can get the file link with a shortcut thank you for watching this video for more information on google drive under the description you find click link to the post by clicking on link to the post you will find more information on our website and then go to your portal okay and you subscribe to this channel by clicking the bell icon see an update anytime we upload new videos